All right, let's get started. I am using Kat Von D's Trooper Tattoo Liner and I'm using Sephora Collections Black Colorful Wing It Felt Liner. First, I'm taking Kat Von D's Trooper Tattoo Liner and I am basically sketching out the shape that I want in my crease. And then I'm going to kind of dip it and then wing it up. So right now I'm just drawing the outline of what how I want the crease to look. And now I am taking the Sephora collection liner and I'm going to start filling that in. This one is like a tad bit more wet when using it so it's easier to get more of a solid line. So I'm just going through and thickening that up. And then I'm going to start drawing my dots. So they're going to be more concentrated towards the solid wing. And then as you move further away, they're going to kind of disperse. So just continuing to do that throughout the length of the wing. And next I'm going to go in with the NYX Vivid Brights Liquid Liners in Vivid Petal and Vivid Fire. And first taking Vivid Fire, I'm going to start dotting that on top of the black. Just randomly all over. Going back into the black because I felt like it needed some more dots up top. And now I'm going in with Vivid Petal, the light pink, and I'm drawing more dots. And now I'm actually going in with the Sigma Pink Line Ace and drawing some dots over that. Going back in with NYX's Vivid Petal Liquid Liner, drawing some tinier dots. And now going in again with my Sephora Black Felt Liner and drawing some more black dots. And now I'm going in with my MAC Pro Longwear Concealer and this paintbrush and my Firma Beauty 203 brush. And I am cleaning up the cut crease with this. And since I didn't put a primer on my lids today, I'm going to take this all over my lid after I clean up the crease.
And then I'm going to take MAC Long Type with this Bare Minerals Shadow Brush and I am setting all of that concealer. So here's what I have so far. Next I'm going in with my Sigma's Pink Line Ace and I am drawing a wing with this across my lash line. And I was trying to make this really symmetrical to the other side. That's why I kind of have to go back and clean it up because I want these to be really symmetrical and even. Okay, on to the inner corner point. So I'm just extending that down and then I'm making a point and then pulling it back in. It almost looks like a bird's beak. Cleaning up the outside wing with concealer. Making sure that's super sharp. And then I'm going to go into the inner corner and clean up that. And then I'm taking this cosmetics pencil brush because this is a very small area. So I'm going to use this to blend out my concealer. And I will be applying House of Lashes Iconics. And this is the finished eye look. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you're not already. And I will see you on my next video. Bye guys.